Yeah, you can get out of your way as well. Okay, I'm just entering up the stairs. So 248 uh, is only accessible from the back stairs. There's no front door here. Uh, we do actually have a door um, that goes to the front door, oh. but it's in a storage closet, which goes off the second bedroom. So, so do you have a second two. exit for emergencies? We do, yeah, that's oh, good. the one. That yeah. is the so one, okay. So we don't okay. have one that goes directly outside. Okay, but it goes out the hallway. Goes the hallway. Okay, yeah, perfect. Exactly. So to enter, I came up the stairs from outside and walked into the kitchen. The tenant is home, so if you hear me chatting with her. And a little tiny closet, very narrow and the electrical 100 amp panel is there. Lovely high ceilings. Ceiling looks like it's in good condition. Tile floor in the kitchen. Stainless fridge, stainless stove. Now there is some damage above that window, but it looks like it's been done for years. It looks like they dropped the ceiling down and cut the window in half because the frame looks like it used to go up higher than the ceiling for whatever reason. This tenant's been here three and a half years. She'd like to stay. Only problem she's had is she's told me there has been some leaking in over the bay window. So beautiful, large living dining room combination. Huge high ceilings with all the ornate features you'd expect of a building this old. That is wallpaper on the ceiling, and you can see it peeling in places. It just needs to be glued back up. And here is the bay window. She told me, depending on the direction of the wind and the rain, you can see where she's had some water come in. And sometimes when the, she said the gutters clog, that can send the water backing up too. So it's a maintenance item. There are double windows. This used to be a door, but it's been sealed off now as a window. Um, and I see like storm windows on it. So this double pane windows. They're cold, but it's not particularly drafty. Original hardwood floors. In decent shape. Lovely woodwork with Boston headers. I mean, the molding is just incredible. Look at that. And that's what's so nice about these old buildings. But you can see where the water has damaged that lovely original woodwork. It's swollen. It looks like it's a veneer because it's swollen right there. That can't be sanded down. That would have to be cut out and replaced with a an oak plywood or something and stain to back. Hello, oh, kitty cat. Okay, huge high ceilings in the hallway. So the bathroom has washer dryer in it, tile flooring in the bathroom, bathtub sink or bathtub shower combination. Needs a little bit of caulking in the shower. And washer dryer combination. And a little bit of damage on that ceiling. Now, she did say that there was a leak from the upstairs tenant several years ago. It stopped, but the ceiling wasn't fixed. So you can see where the plaster ceilings have cracked and they wallpapered over them instead of actually fixing them. There's no apparent sign of any current water, but you can see the damage. And that's just some cracking. And there is an electric insert in the fireplace, which I'm assuming is the tenant's little fireplace. And the washer and dryer is ours. As well. And the washer and dryer is the tenant's as well, she's telling me. And then this is a two bedroom apartment. She's using one as an office. Big high ceilings. Those are twenty foot ceilings. Um, oh yeah, I mean, yeah, something like that, I think. Yeah. And she has um, her emergency exit is through a storage room, and it goes out into the hallway down the stairs. She's just using it for storage currently. She was kind enough to open the door. 
which is off its hinges. It needs to be put back on for her. And lastly, the master bedroom. Hello, kitty cat. Huge master bedroom, beautiful ornate fireplace that's just been filled in with tile. Lovely, 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 but not enough closet space because they've overflowed it with a clothing rack. That's just like enough clothing today for one person and not necessarily a lady. And that concludes the, the tour of this apartment.